seeing Katie walk towards me and my knees were shaking, my heart was in my throat and I was the happiest I could have been. The Bachelor's Zach Shalcross is engaged to Katie Bigger. It was such a special moment, such a special day and I was just elated. Zach tells people that since the first time he met Katie, she's exuded everything he's been looking for. That kindness, that loving, funny, sweet, independent, beautiful person from the very beginning. And I always felt so pulled and attracted to her. And she was someone that throughout the entire process, it was becoming so easy in my mind that, yeah, this, this person is my future. And now the pair is planning their future together, but that doesn't mean walking down the aisle just yet. Right now, I, I think that the main emphasis is living together in Austin, getting to know each other more and more, spend that really special time together and, and just see how things go. You know, there's no rush. I know the show is technically dictating you rushing in a sense, like people <laughs> can get that. But for us, it's, it's not about that. It's, it's taking our time, spending time with each other just enjoying it. We have like the rest of our lives together. So why does everything need to be a rush? It doesn't. So yeah. Yeah. We're just enjoying each other's company. And like we've said previously, just getting to know each other more. And we don't need to have like pedal to the metal 24 seven. And like Zach and I want this to work out. We want this so bad. So why, why rush everything? And before they tie the knot, they're looking forward to traveling more of the world together. I really <laughs> want to go to Portugal. I think Portugal is beautiful from the pictures that I've seen. My best friend, Nat, she actually went there with her family and she had nothing but amazing things to say about it. So I really want to go there. There's tons of places that I want to go and I know Zach does too. So um, we're both very adventurous. So I'm sure you'll see us uh, going off to different places. While they're holding off on wedding planning, Katie admits that she does have a five-year plan. Hopefully married with kids and happy. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what life has in store for us, but I think, um, and obviously Zach, you can touch on this too, because I don't speak for you as well, but hopefully, yeah, family, marriage, adventures, lots of traveling. 100% married with some little ones running around, maybe one, maybe two, who knows. <laughs> uh, um, but like before then, I know uh, Katie and I have talked, we want to travel a little bit, you know, we're going to start living in Austin, but you know, after a year in Austin, figure out if we want to try something else and kind of explore and, and, and travel the world. And then by that time, little ones. Congrats to the happy couple.